This is not financial advice. This is not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only and everything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decisions based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, like YouTube algorithm and stuff so you get the videos I put them out so you don't think and see I'm analyzing that data. Listen, the FTX debacle is like the crime that keeps on giving. <laughs> Every single day, we, like, we peel the onion back and we just believe more and more corruption, more and more criminal activity. It's absolutely outrageous. Today, we found out that the house that they have in the Bahamas, which is in his parents' name, <laughs> the house was bought point for $16.4 billion. The house was bought with FTX funds, but his mother and father's name was on the deed. Now, he's a legend that it was supposed to be temporarily in their name, and the house was supposed to be for FTX employees to stay. Have you ever seen anything so outrageous, so corrupt, and the explanation is totally nonsense it makes absolutely no sense and this is just my opinion they were just stealing cash from the company and now that john ray the third is going through the books and everything is being brought to light he's coming up with these lame duck excuses for his criminal behavior he's coming up with these lame duck excuses for stealing investors money and giving it to almeda He's coming up with these lame duck excuses for getting a billion dollar loan and not knowing where the money went. This guy is a criminal. And if he wasn't a one percenter, if his and his co-conspirators, and that's what I that's what I think they are, his co-conspirators weren't so powerful, he would already be in handcuffs. Why isn't the IRS on his ass? How do you take 16.4 million dollars out of your company, buy a house in your parents' name, and now, because all the evidence is coming to light, you want to claim it was supposed to be in their name temporarily. Anyway, hit the like button, subscribe button, like YouTube algorithm. Tell me what you think about Sam Beckman Fried putting a 60.4 million dollar house in his parents' name with FTX funds. Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.